Yeah, I'm going to say a prison and I'm going to say, I'm going to show you how 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 to show you I am exalt brother to stay, you know, focused, you know, on this part because you know, you know, being in this truth, you know, it comes a lot. Especially now we in a time now when you know he saw you know is getting ready now to you know um making MOTV become monetary worldwide. Right and you know a lot of things are happening. You know, you have trials, you know, you know, different different, you know things we have basically a deal with the true day life, you know, living in the society. Right, but at the end of the day, you know, if we basically, you know, hold, hold fast to this truth, you know, and continue on to the end, right, because we have to finish work in order to basically, you know, uh, make it true, right, we're supposed to, you know, still have that mindset, go on, brother. I will bear the indignation of the Lord because I have sinned against him. God says, if I say, I will bear the indignation of the Lord, right, Micah? You know, saying, so he, he will bear the indignation of the Lord because he have sinned against him. We sin against so far. Okay. Right? All the things um, we have got through right now, as Peter said, you know, our own wickedness are caricus. Right? So we understand and know the reason why, you know, we have got through all these things. You know, the regular jig out there, you know, have a clue. You know what really take place. The scripture says, though the Lord stricken them, yet they don't grieve. I'm not talking about bring up a scripture, brother. Before we go further, um, Jeremiah 5, you know, and verse, start of verse 1. This is Yeah. As they said, even men, even men understand that judgment. But they don't see the Lord understand all things. Lord put, put that spirit upon we um we understand all of that man. regular now I get it because them living on them evil ways yeah one okay, Jeremiah 5 and start the one yeah so run ye to and fro through the street of Jerusalem and, and see no and no and seek broad place thereof and um if ye can find a man if there be any that execute judgment, um, that seek it the truth and will pardon it. So, and though they say the Lord liveth, surely they swear it falsely. But this is the point I want to get from the scripture. What? He said, O Lord, are not thine eyes upon the truth, thou hast stricken them, but they have not grieved. Can? Thou hast consumed them, but they have refused to receive correction. Can they refuse to receive correction? We understand, as I mentioned, you know, we understand, you know, the reason why, you know, we in this situation, you know, are, are, are basically this lifestyle of people living. We understand the reason why it takes place, right? Because it's tell us, right? But the regular J code, they, you know, I have no, no direction, you know? I don't understand how basically it takes place. There's a try, you know, to find some, you know, other basically things, you know, because if I tell us in, um, in um, Romans 11, so what then Israel have not obtained it, that which he seek it for, but what the election have obtained it and the rest were blind. So Jacob out there trying to find some, you know, some, you know, um, solution to them problem, but they must seek to the other things away right. from the Heavenly Father. But the Heavenly Father, how about Hashem, shall have mercy on us, you know, and take us from, you know, to the darkness and bring us to this light. Right, so we understand the reason why we, you know, in this situation, and what the reason why Esau, you know, you know, the lowest of men, you know, above us, right? Man. Man. So we have hope. We have hope in the house of Hashem because we know say very soon, you know, all this, this um, madness we have to deal with in the society, living in the society, are come to an end, right? We're not gonna ever go through no more of these bullshit, yo. Yeah, go on, brother. So those consume them. But they have refused to receive correction. Oh, people refuse to, to receive correction. What? Because correction is grievous and to him and for safe way. What? He said, 
they have made their faces harder than a rock. Right. They have refused to return. Um, therefore I said, surely these are poor, they are foolish, for they know not the way of the Lord, nor the judgment of their poor. Exactly. Again, Micah 7 and 9 says, I will bear the indignation of the Lord, because I have sinned against him. Can't say, Jipa, say. I will bear the indignation of the Lord, I will bear the indignation of the Lord, righteous anger, because we have sinned against him. Right? Until he plead my cause and execute judgment for me, he will bring me forth to the light, and I will behold his righteousness. God, and he bring, and he bring us to the light, because he said, the road is our love and the light, and the light and bring us to this truth. Right, and give us the understanding, you know, how the scripture, you know, actually, you know, speaking about. We actually give us the understanding, the reason why we in this situation are in this lifestyle. Right now, more people. Right? So we have the understanding. We're glad you caught the door of it. So all, all the things that we have got through, we understand and know that you know this is basically you know part of you know being in this truth because the keeper tell us, you know, that you know when we come to the truth, all the things that we have, we have to go through, right? Especially me yeah. and scripture, the anthem, you know, um, Ecclesiasticus 2, you know, one hand out. My son did thou come to serve the Lord with fear thy soul for temptation. Right, and more and more as the day go by, I go closer and closer to the end of this society, you know, more trials, you know, you know, things we have to deal with, you know, being in this truth. Yeah. Right? Because all different type of, you know, um, evil spirits, you know, and jerk, you know, all around. Because we live now in a society governed by the wicked, you know, all different type of witchcraft, you know, push, you know, in the society. Right? Yeah. He says, I will bear the indignation of the Lord um, because I have sinned against him until he plead my cause and execute judgment for me. He will bring me forth to the light and I shall behold his righteousness. Exactly. Right? And we sit, we sit in this life, but before we do, in this life and also past life. So we get punished for what we do in this life and also past life. Right, because you know on the earth I can't work in the scripture is a, is, is a place of judgment. I can't work in you know, um, um, Ecclesiastes I believe 3 and verse and verse 16. I believe it's a moreover I saw all of the sun, the place of judgment is basically on the earth. So you will basically face so punishment, you know, for doing a this life and also past life. That's right. Right? Give it up. Right, this is the book of second Maccabee 7. Start of verse 31. Okay. Um, it says, And thou that hast been the author of all mischief against the Hebrews shall not escape the hands of Yahweh, for we, for we suffer because of our sins. So the reason why we, are, we are suffer because of our sins is that ultimately have to fulfill prophecy. Yes, because when I said to Esau, you say it's not. And we now suffer because you actually have put me under the punishment. We are suffer because we sin against our power. And he used and he used Esau you know, to punish us. Punish us. Yeah, can't. That's why I put it in the Maccabees as brother mentioned. Can't. Right? Then Esau and Esau lift up his head and he said, basically, he moved them people here and I'm man. And he can do whatever he wants to do with them. See? Because and then, but you are the one who do it. See? And the Lord. See? And though, it says, and though the living Lord be angry with us a little while, little while for right? our chastening. Our chastening. Yeah. Skipa said, would the Lord love it? Chastening. Can. Right. We're going to ask scripture to read that. Where they are. Hebrews. Hebrews 12 and 10. Uh, and 10 and 10. Yeah, somewhere else. I think at 12 and 10. Yes. Hebrews 12 verse. For whom the Lord loveth, he chasteneth, and, and scourgeth every son whom he receiveth. Plans. This person who the Lord loveth, he chasteneth. Saying, chasten us. You know, all the things that we have basically got through, you know, being in this church, as people say, um, do some strange things happen to you. Right? So you are a chasten us. 
really and truly are purified in our spirit. Which is right. Right? The things that we are going through are basically, you know, um, get out in you know, a certain worldly things from us basically out of us. Because you know the flesh, we live, we live in a you know, society, you know, and the flesh always seeking comfort. You know, no matter if we're wrong or right, the flesh always seeking comfort. So they may find out chasing us because they love us. Go on. Um, for whom the Lord loveth he chasteneth, God. and scourgeth every son whom he receiveth. God. If he endure chastening, Yahweh dealeth, dealeth with you as with sons. God. For what son is he whom the Father chasteneth not? God. So, um, God. It says, um, back to Maccabees, um, seven, second Maccabees 7 and 33 again. God. It says, And thou, the living Lord, be angry with us, God. A little while for our chastening and correction, yet shall he be at one again with his servants. Right. Yes. Okay. Okay. But thou, O oh godless man, and of all other most wicked, okay, be not lift up without a cause, nor puffed up with uncertain hopes, lifting up thy hand against the servants of Yahweh. Right. 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 I don't want no um, authority. Right. The scripture, scripture says, um, the earth is given into the hands of the wicked. So you know, basically, doing all this wickedness to people for years. Right. As scripture says in um, Psalms, Psalms, Psalms 25, and verse 5, so speak not to that stiff neck. Not from motion coming neither from the east nor from the west, Can. nor from the south, but even the father of Yahweh, he's the judge. He put it up down one and set it up another. Can. So he's a item above us right now. And our press our people, you know, and doing all this madness in this earth, in, in the earth right now. You know, and a lot of them things are somehow, you know, they are content to do what they want to do. Right, but we in a time now when they're finally gonna get judged. Can. And also two to our people. Right, because you know a lot of our people. They might want to be oppressing us too. Yet. Right? Go on, brother. He yeah. says, um, it says, for thou has not yet escaped the judgment of Almighty, of Almighty God, yeah. who seeth all things. Uh -huh. For our brethren who now have suffered a short pain are dead under God's covenant of everlasting life. But thou but thou, through the, the judgment of the hour, shall receive just punishment for thy pride. Right. Yeah. Right. Then, you know, for going back, you know, as brother mentioned, you know, about the evil boys, you know, you have, you know, Antiochus, you know, but then, you know, put a lot of hell on our people. Right. You have uh, the same evil boys, by right? them basically, you know, go through a lot of things in other people. You know, he saw you know, forcing them even go, to go as far as, he saw you know, go as far as to beg the mother. To make the son, it, it basically poor. Yeah. To show the, the, the mindset of these men. And we're heading to a time now when all of us are going to get tested. You know? As we can speak about the whole of the nation. That's where we're heading towards right now. But then, during the time of the Greeks, it was poor. You know? This time around, it's going to be what? MOTV. That's what Esau and Edom are going to try to use. Right. You know? To basically, um, Trap a lot of people in the time to come are, 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 are. Try to basically give the whole world a cause with the scripture say. Hey, I'm, I'm basically we saw now really um I say my target in a regular joke man in yeah. this truth in a, in, a, in a the world and then you know you target them because him actually just want to do it zin to do it sick zin him want to do it denounce with poor men Zin. And he's not going to attack the regular Jake because regular Jake already denounced the how about Shemir and Shire. He might come for the elect. He might come for men of the truth. Zin. Yeah. You understand the other part? Yes. So you saw the souls of them that were beaded you know, for the weakness. They even for the how they were shy. But they were not going to receive Isa, you know, you know digital device. And see him. So then he basically saw the future. Gun. Already, what we are about to take place, you know, in the near future. Yeah, as you said, right. the elect are the main target. Regular Jack already, I will receive it. <laughs> a lot yeah, of them are taking it. Yeah, yeah. 
So the, uh, the, the, main, the main target are going to be the, the elect. And them are the ones who try to push the, the pressure upon to, yeah. to receive this one. To receive the, to receive the um, whatever the device they come with. Yeah? And my, my you willingly accept it. You push it upon yourself. You take it just like what I'm at during the time of the Hebrew boys. Right. Right. Scripture, brother. You find it, Daniel? 725. shall speak great words against the Most High and shall wear out the sins of the Most High and think to change, change times and laws and they shall be given into his hand until a time and times and dividing of times. So they shall be given into his hand over hand, he saw he don't hand. Right? So he will wear out the sins of the Most High. Who are the sins? Right, they can bring out Psalms 100 48 from brother and verse 14. And bring out the definition for the word we are now. You bring out Psalms for us. Are you going to go on? Psalms 148? Yeah, Psalms 148 and 14. Psalms 148. And verse 14. Verse 14. Go on. Then it says, He also exalt, um, exalt, exalted the arm of his people. Go on. The praise of all his saints, even of the children of Israel. The children of Israel are the saints, right? The so-called niggas, Latinos, you know, Native American, Indian. Right? 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 They shall be given into his hand, right? According to, according to the curse, you know, basically in Deuteronomy. Right? Right? The Lord will send, you know, send Esau, Edom, you know, against us. Even of the even of the children of Israel, a people near unto him. Yeah. Praise ye the Lord. Yeah. How about show me your shot? Yeah. Um, we're not um Hebrew by the loud allow and to wear away, wear out, to harass constant. To harass constant. Alright, so this is a sign. To harass constant, they came out the definition to um, to, um, to harass. Uh, harass. They came out and came out and came Harass. Now because as, as you know, been saying it, you know, starting the apostles and elders are now, this is not our king. Right, this is not our you know, the people that even father is supposed to live. This is not life, you know, as a person of our, you know, how we used to say, right, we exist, we exist right now. We are living, right? As a chosen people that even father, we are supposed to live, to live this way. Right? Definition to harass on the mirror and website it says, um, to annoy or bother someone um, in a constant or repeated way. Says to make repeated attacks against an enemy. Repeated attacks against an enemy. Right? The number one enemy. I are the Israelite or the so-called white man. Psalms 83. Say they're, they're, they're confederate against thee. Yeah, can. Yeah. They say, come and let us cut them off from being a nation that the name of Israel may be one. No more in remembrance. Are you heading this? Tabernacle of who? Edom. Our number one enemy is the so called white people. Right, the Edomites. So they're repeatedly attacking us here, constantly. Right? In all different ways, all different styles. Food, here, you know, the witchcraft, all these, thi all these things are basically been, you know, used against our people. Right. All different ways to be a scholar attacking us. Alright, go on, brother. Um, don't you know the etymology of the same arras? Um, say from terror to set, to set a dog on, um, interject used to incite dogs. And it reminds me of the scripture I would say the dogs 
um, a liquid sources. I constantly um, have us down, and while we're down, still put in a um, retirement to go now. Should go back to the Eden yeah, Nation. Okay. Right. One, the heat is just equals two, and verse one. Well, so my son, though come to serve the Lord, to pay thy soul for temptation, okay. set thy heart aright, and constantly endure. Okay. So, if you come to serve the Lord, I'm supposed to, you know, endure temptation, because you're going to get tempted. Right? Okay. We're going to go through trials. You know, the Ahab Hashemesh are going to prove us. You know, if we basically were ready enough, you know, basically receive all the goodies. Right? So all the things that we might put us through, all the trials, all the temptations. Right? Go on. And make that ace in time of trouble. Okay. So you we're not supposed to make ace in the time of trouble. Go on. It says, cleave unto him and depart not away. Go on. That thou mayest be increased at thy last end. Can. That thou may be increased at thy last end. Can. Exactly. That's the case, Kali. Go on, bro. Can you hear me? Right, go on. Okay. It says, Whatsoever is brought upon thee, take cheerfully, and be, and be patient, when thou art changed to a low estate. Can. It says, For gold is tried in the fire, and acceptable men in the furnace of adversity. Can. So, 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 so we're going to go through trials, you know, in this show. More and more as the time go by, especially the time we're approaching right now is basically on the hour of temptation. All of us gonna get tried. Hopefully you're gonna get tested at limit. Right? Enjoy uh, this is a good soldier. Yeah. Yeah. Second Corinthians 4, verse 16. It says, um, it says, For which cause we faint not. It says, For which cause we faint not. But, but though our outward man perish, yet the inward man is renewed day by day. Because it's supposed to our outward man perish, you know, so the flesh, you know, go through a lot of things, you know, a lot of sickness, right? Trials and all these things, you know, because you know, the flesh is weak, uh, as um, scripture said, right? And you know, the flesh always has seek comfort, right? So, in a certain time, you know, you're always, you know, in a certain situation, you know, you have to basically, you know, rely on the spirit because, you know, the, you know, the spirit is basically what, you know, guide us, in, right? Because the flesh always seeking comfort, right? You know, no matter if it's right or wrong, always seeking comfort. So the scripture said, the outward man perish, yet the inward man, which is the spirit, is renewed day by day. So the flesh is perishing, but the spirit are renewed. So it becomes, you know, stronger, more and more, you know, as the day goes by, you know, spiritually. Can. Right, go on. It says, for our light of it, our light of affliction, affliction, which is but for a moment. So all the things that we are going to right now, the scripture said, the Lord, you know, punish us. You know, for all the things that we basically been, been doing all our sins, we've been punished for our sins, right? It's because of our light affliction, both for a moment, not forever. Right. It's just for a period of time. And we're coming closer and closer to the end of it, you know? And you're going to get, you know, more, you know, you're going to increase more and more as the day go by. And closer and closer we get to the end, you know, more and more trials, more temptation are come our way. You know, we just have to just beg the heavenly Father to give us the strength, you know, and the faith to push through. Can't. Right, because they're gonna come. Scripture tell us it. So we're gonna get tried. We're gonna get tested. So we're gonna for us a far more exceeding and eternal weight of glory. In why we look not at the things which are seen, Can. but at the things which are not seen. In for the things which are seen are temporal, Can. but the things which but the things which are not seen are eternal. Can. This is the kingdom. Can. That's basically a way, you know, our heart like. People say, where your treasure is, there will your heart also be. Can. Right? Our basically the mind is, you know, to receive, you know, the kingdom. Our mind is, how we shall come back any day now to come deliver us from this society? Which is right. That's our hope, that's our aim. Right? The regular check amongst our people, right? Them basically trying to make it, 
you know, some of them are going to be rich one day in the society and live a happy life, you know. And it's not going to happen because this is not our kingdom. Right? This is not, you know, the kingdom of heaven. This is Esau, he do kingdom. And how we And how hell. How we are the one that face all the hardship in the society. The worst of the worst, you know, how people have been doing in the society. This is not our kingdom. You know. Jacob, open this. We now have open here. In this kingdom here, we have open, the, you know, the kingdom to come. Yes, so we're supposed to, you know, stay focused, you know. At times, you know, you go through, you, know, you go through certain, you know, um, tribulation. Right, but you know what, just try to hold on, you know, and try to stay focused, right? Mm -hmm. Don't get too distracted from this truth because that's one of the things you know, to get too distracted from what, what is basically really important, which is this truth. Oh, the will of the Lord, man. Right. And this is all me and him. Yeah. This is one of the reasons why, one well, of the main reasons why we're still living right now, is to push this truth, yeah. right? Yeah, basically, we have to understand the word, yeah. Yeah. this thing, man. And the Lord, the Lord could not stick up to anybody and put them in. So we have to, we have to really appreciate where we really we get done to it mm -hmm. by we by the Lord um, accepting us and put us in this truth. Mm -hmm. See? We have to really appreciate that and show the appreciation by putting in um, the work to the fullest. Mm -hmm. See? See? At, at all costs, man. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Exactly. He's right. We're going to society, you know, the, your, your, your work. You know, you have Jake work or, or we work. Can. And you go to your job and you do certain work. We require a few, you know, individuals in doing this work. When you come to our shy thing, we're supposed to be more serious than even, you know, regular job. Because when you say that be a regular job, you know, you know, um, tomorrow you promise you're in the job. Because anything can happen, you can go to the job and you get fired. But this is one of the main things where I'm going to bring a lot of, you Can't. know, good, goodness to us here. Right, because if I once you have a shy come, we're not gonna ever go through none of these shit. We have whole about, you know, boss I'm gonna fire, you know, or I'm gonna lay you off, you know, and you get suspended. But this truth I was supposed to focus mainly upon right now. Right? I mean, this is this is the job where you want to get fired from. <laughs> yeah. You know, but here's the other men who hold the truth. Right. Most important thing right now is pushing this truth. Right. So with that, I say all praises and honor to you. And no blindness to the apostles, to the elders of Graham and Stone. Shalom to all the brothers and more dear pushing the show to the sincerity and honesty. Shalom. Shalom.